Good job. Hi, boys and girls. Teacher Ella here with Hazel. Hazel's here with me today. We're going to read a very silly book. It's called That's Good. That's Bad. It's by Marjorie Collier and pictures by David Cottrell. David Cottrell. Mm -hmm. That's who drew the pictures. All right, are you ready? Okay, yeah, i one day, a little boy went to the zoo with his mother and father. They bought him a shiny red balloon. I can see it. It lifted him high up into the sky. Wow. Oh, that's good. <laughs> no, that's bad. No, that's bad. That's going to be that great. The balloon drifted for miles and miles until it came to a hot, steamy jungle. It broke on the branch of a tall, prickly tree. Pop! Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's good. No, that's good. <laughs> no. The little boy fell into a muddy river. Splat! He climbed onto a roly-poly hippopotamus and rode to shore. Giddy up! Oh, that's good. That's bad. No, that's bad. And noisy baboons were squabbling in the grass by the river. They chased the little boy up a tree, and he was out of breath. Pant, pant. Oh, that's bad. That's good. No, that's good. The baboons wanted to play vine swing with the little boy. What fun. The little boy grabbed a vine and swung out of their reach. Whee. Oh, that's good. That's good. No, I said, oh, that's good. No, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. Uh-oh, let's see why it's bad. <gasps> the vine was a big, scary snake that wiggled and jiggled and hissed. Oh, that's bad. That's good. Hmm. The little boy lost his grips, whoops, and landed on the back of a giraffe. Hooray. Oh, that's good. That's bad. No, that's bad. Bad. The giraffe leaned over to drink some swampy water. Glug, glug. The little boy slid down its neck and fell into some quicksand next to an elephant. Slop. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. And that's good. No, oh, that's good. The elephant grabbed the little boy with its trunk and lifted him up, up, up onto its shoulders. Whoosh. Oh, that's good. That's bad. No, that's bad. That's bad. <laughs> it keeps telling us the opposite, huh? The elephant thumped bumpily on to a grassy plain where it stopped to feed. The little boy climbed down its trunk and woke up a daddy lion snoring in the grass. Zzz. Oh, that's bad. That's good. Oh, that's good. Hmm. <laughs> When the lion saw the little boy, it purred and licked the little boy's face. Slurp. Oh, that's good. That's bad. No, that's bad. Let's see why that's bad. Okay. Oh, the little boy got all wet and sticky. Yuck. And ran deeper into the jungle. It was as dark as night. Whoa. And the little boy was afraid. He sat down and started to cry. Boo -hoo. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. No, that's good. Let's see why that's good. Okay. His tear made such a big puddle that a stork came along to have a drink. Sip. It picked up the little boy with its beak. Whoosh, whoosh. Oh, that's good. That's bad. Let's see why that's bad. Oh, that's bad. Bad. The store flew the little boy across the dark, windy sky. Flap, flap, flap. The little boy thought he would never see his parents again. Oh, that's bad. That's good. Let's see why that's good. Oh, that's good. The stork knew where it was going. It took the little boy back to the zoo and dropped him into his parents' arms. Plop. His mother and father were so happy to see him, they gave him a big hug and a big kiss. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. No, that's great. Great. 
says, no, that's good. No, that's great. Hey. So there is our silly story to say, share with you guys. All right, have a good rest of the day. Can you say bye, Hazel? Bye. Bye. I still have to show myself.